The 25th day of December, when ages beyond number had run their course from the creation of the world, when God in the beginning created heaven and earth and formed man in his own likeness, when century upon century had passed since the Almighty set his bow in the clouds after the great flood as a sign of covenant and peace. In the twenty-first century since Abraham, our father in faith, came out of the earth of the Chaldees, in the thirteenth century since the people of Israel were led by Moses in the exodus from Egypt, around the thousandth year since David was anointed king, in the sixty-fifth week of the prophecy of Daniel, in the one hundred and ninety-fourth Olympiad, in the year 752, since the foundation of the city of Rome. In the 42nd year of the reign of Caesar Octavian Augustus, the whole world being at peace. Jesus Christ, eternal God and Son of the Eternal Father, desiring to consecrate the world by his most loving presence, was conceived by the Holy Spirit. And when nine months had passed since his conception, was born of the Virgin Mary in Bethlehem of Judah, and was made man. The Nativity of our Lord Jesus Christ, according to the flesh. 